You're a little different than most of the guys here. You've been coming here, what, seven, eight years now? Yeah, since uh, sixth grade, about that early. A um, lot of great Maine South quarterbacks that have played yeah. your position. Yeah, uh, Sean Price, Tyler Knight, John Shackey. There's a lot of them. I can probably name a few more. Do you feel uh, compelled to kind of carry that tradition on? Uh, sort of, but I also have a lot of coaches that are there for me. Like Coach Bliss, he's been mentoring me for since I've been coming here since sixth grade. So at the same time, I've been having some of the best teaching in the state. So that helps out a lot. All right, so sixth grade, seventh grade, eighth grade, three years of high school. I mean, six years now you've been giving up your Sunday nights. Yeah. How do your friends respond to that? I mean, it's Sundays. You know, nothing really happens Sunday, so there's not a better place to be than here. And I, I have a lot of friends here, too, that I've, uh, you know, just recently became friends with just through here that otherwise I would have no idea who they are. That was going to be my next question. I asked the other guys, uh, you know, when I played football in high school, the only guys that I knew were the guys in my locker room. Yeah. The guy on the other team I didn't like and never liked. I mean, here you get an opportunity to socialize and, and, and build some friendships, I would think. Yeah, I've met a lot of people uh, that I'm actually real good friends with that I, now we work out like three times a week together. So it's a good chance to come out here and make some new friends. Guys from rival high schools. Yeah, yeah, like conference rivals. <laughs> so I'm, we're friends, you know, once we work out, but once the like, season starts, we don't, we don't talk as much, especially when we play each other. Like during the game, it's it's all back to you know enemies. I would assume this is a silly question, but I want to hear your take on it anyway. Uh, this has been a real positive experience for you, and you you can really feel yourself getting better all the time here. Yeah, right? I definitely can, because I come here, I come out here and try to compete as much as I can with some of the top quarterbacks in the state. And uh, we even have kids like last year travel like eight hours, so you know it's a good chance to gauge yourself to see how you know how you compare to the other quarterbacks that come out here. When you get home tonight, turn on that cell phone, those text messages are there. Your buddy's like, man, what are you doing on a Sunday? Yeah, How do you explain this to him? Uh, I'm, I just tell him, you know, I come out here, try to get better, do, do whatever I can. I want to play football at the highest level in college. So whatever I need to do, that's what I'm going to do. Has that recruiting process started for you? Uh, yeah, I've been to uh, about seven or eight colleges so far. What, what, what have been some of the ones that you really had a favorable experience? Um, I really liked Illinois. I was there a few weeks ago. That was the second time I've been there this year. Um, I also like Wisconsin and Iowa. I was nice as well as Purdue and uh, Michigan and I'm going to Virginia pretty soon. Have you gotten any offers yet? Um, I don't have any offers. Illinois is the closest. They said they just want me to uh, come down for the one day and if I throw good then they said they'll offer. Uh, do you plan on taking five official visits? Um, well I, I haven't really thought about that yet. I just want to I'm just going to take it you know how, however it goes and if the right situation pre presents itself then that's what I'm going to take. You know, you dream all your life of being a college football player, and then the recruiting process starts. Sometimes it can start to build a little pressure. Have you felt any of that? Um, I felt it a little bit. I'm sure there'll be more to come, but, you know, I think it'll all be worth it because, you know, there has to be pressure. To, like, all the coaches are going to be talking to you to try to convince you to come to their school. So I'm just going to listen to every coach that talks to me, you know, respect what they have to say, and just weigh my options. Very good, Charlie. Pleasure to meet Thank you. you. All right. Pleasure to meet you. Too.